Welcome back to another NFL free agency video, and before we get into the football stuff, this Aaron Rodgers news that he could be considering running for Bryce, vice president in the middle of the NFL season is taking the football world by storm and all over the internet. It's going viral, and the interesting thing about this is Aaron Rodgers, we don't know if this is true or not. We don't know if this is ever going to happen or if this is just a crazy report, but Aaron Rodgers a couple months ago made it clear that he wanted this Jets season to be all about winning and since then he there's been multiple distractions around him including this latest report that he would consider running for vice president in the middle of the season so let me know your thoughts on this the titans come out and sign calvin ridley to a big extension or a big deal i should say four years 92 million 23 mil per year and 50 mil guaranteed and the titans with gm ron carthen have had a very good off season so far they got Calvin Ridley, they got Tony Pollard, along with a couple other additions as well to build around young quarterback Will Levis that they hope is the future of their franchise. The Chargers are going to be releasing Mike Williams. He's going to be coming off a torn ACL, but this wasn't the move talent related. Mike Williams will have interest and will get picked up. It's just the Chargers need to make some moves for their cap space situation. The Eagles are having a reunion with Chauncey Gardner Johnson, CJ GJ to a three year deal worth up to 33 million the eagles need that toughness back that he brought when they were in the super bowl and they didn't have last year patrick mahomes is restructuring his contract to create 21.6 million worth of salary cap space this could be used maybe for a legerious sneed or something else that the chiefs use as they're on the quest to become the first ever team to three-peat the Vegas odds do not think that Derrick Henry will help the Ravens, as if you look at their Super Bowl odds, their AFC odds, and their division odds, they all remained exactly the same after they signed King Henry to a two-year deal. The Dallas Cowboys are now the only NFL team that hasn't signed a single free agent yet, and this is coming on the heels of Jerry Jones saying that they were going to go all in this year, so maybe he's talking about some extensions, but there hasn't been a single move done yet. Justin Jefferson bought is definitely getting loud and there's a lot of people wondering could he possibly be on the trade market people are trying to hypothetical or drop hypothetical trade scenarios for him to the Bengals. but Adam Schefter did say it's not a layup that a deal gets done they still have to work some things out for the extension but according to the athletic the Vikings have no plans to trade Justin Jefferson they are trying hard to extend him they came close to extending him last offseason so I think inevitably the most likely scenario is Jefferson gets paid by Minnesota. It's just negotiations at this point. Subscribe if you like these videos. That's what's going on.